Yeah. Now I'm going to. Uh, it's a bit special this because I'm. I'm moving components from one board to another. It's just because. I don't want to. Run around the lab to get all the parts. It's just a new revision of a card, and that's uh, much easier to do it this way. So you will see that some of the solderings are not very good when in the start, but uh, we just fix them after. That's a quite fast way to do it. You just use the double. The tweezer soldering iron. Take it off. Put it back on on this side. What's essential for this is that you need. A lot of flux. That's um, that's kind of mandatory because else you will not be able to get a good joint. Often I just attach it on one side first. Because you will always have a little bit tin left on on the iron, and then you can do the fix. You see there, it was just attached on one side, and so I put it back on and take the other side. Now I do the touch up and then it's getting nice and yeah. That's the easy one. Then we can take this chip here. So yeah, you see, is I will have a lot of tin left on this one. That's good for now, because you can just put it down heat on both sides and then we um, what is important with this solder wick is that we always need to cut off the the tin that's left from the last time then it's easier to just suck it up Not very good. We need some. This solder wick is not very good. It's only solder wick. No clean. You should use the Loctite one. That's really good. But as long as you have some flux, it's okay. Now we take from this side too. Voila. And it's quite nice as you can see. 